Prince Roland has passed his decree. The complete decimation of House Falks is the order of the day. A chilling command, which would see one of Glenbrook's three high houses reduced to bloody rubble. Though penned in the Prince's hand, the order was not his own. Forcing his hand was Archduke Gustadolf, a specter over his shoulders until the ink had dried. House Wolfort is given the command to uproot their erstwhile countrymen, and with heavy hearts, they march. However, the young Serenoa bears hope. Hope that bloodshed can be stopped. Hope that Lord Landroy can be convinced to see reason. Hope that the day is not far off when the realm will know peace again. The Falklands truly are the jewel of Glenbrook. Aye. I don't see Landroy giving him up easily, even if it comes to war. And that is why we will not simply give them up. We shall negotiate, such that benefits may be reaped by all parties. Lord Landroy first among them. He is a reasonable man, yes? That he is, my lord. But we cannot hope to make him see reason if we cannot speak to him face to face. As frosty forces muster at the border, they're preparing to advance. S. Frost, what treachery is this? While we were preparing for the parley, they snuck up on us unawares. What shall we do, my lord? So the Wolfert dogs have already learned some tricks from their new master, eh? We await your command, my lord. Split our forces in two. Send one regiment to the border. I shall lead the other to meet House Wolford in the field. Aye, my lord.
will defend King Regna's gift until the last of us falls. The history shall know that House Fox did not bend the knee. Enough of your schemes, you traitorous dog. Lord Landroy, what is the meaning of this? His arrow's already knocked. What happened to manners, old friend? You'd like that, wouldn't you? For me to give you a hearty embrace while Esfrost cuts me down from behind. Ha! A shameful scheme befitting the cowards who abandoned our prince. Are you mad? We haven't a clue what Esfrost is scheming. Lies! I'll listen to the slithering of snakes no further. We've been swindled. Gustadolf meant to force this battle from the start. Damn it all! Ash in the wind? Smoke from the village! The houses burn! What madness is this, Landroy? You would set your own home ablaze? And what would you have me do with it? Leave it for Esfrost to pillage and plunder? The only thing those bastards will get from me is an arrow through the eye! Shh. They set their arrows alight! Landroy, no! There must be another way! There is no other way, boy. Your treachery saw to that. King Regna, it will not be long ere I stand by your side again. He leaves us no recourse! Swords! <laughs>